Welcome to MarcusG.TV. I'm Chef Marcus Giuliano and I'm a chef on a mission. I'm more like an entrepreneur on a mission. Today's mission is my top 50 mistakes that I see independent small restaurants make and they make them all the time and they're so easy to fix. Mistake number 21, they don't do social media. I know a lot of people that just don't do it. A lot of restaurateur friends of mine don't do it. They don't want to get involved. Either they think that it's not a permanent thing or they, they just have never done it themselves or they think, well, I'm too old for social media. Or they think, you know, I don't want to get the bad reputation online. I can literally spend a full week in your restaurant with you on social media if you want to get that in depth. We don't need to get that in depth. There's a lot of things that are very simple that we can execute within a couple of hours to get you active and we can put them on a system. A lot of my social media, I don't personally sit there and type in every single key. I have it on a system. I have it on a rotation. I have other staff trained to do it. I wish everybody on my Facebook page, my restaurant, a happy birthday. Do you think I sit down every morning and spend a half an hour wishing happy birthdays to everybody? No, it's a job that I delegate out. I'm mean, gonna have a whole thing about delegating and employees and managing to make your job, so, your life so much easier. I'm not trying to give you guys more work by giving you these 50 tips. I'm trying to create more income so you can hire more people so you can do less work. That's what it's about. Social media, you've gotta get involved. You've gotta get on Facebook. You've gotta tweet. The people are talking about you anyway. They're talking about you on Yelp. They're talking about you on these outlets, these platforms. You need to be there to respond in a good and bad way. I'm Chef Marcus Giuliano. I'm a chef on a mission. Thanks for watching. So I've been running my restaurant, Aroma Time, for 10 years in the Hudson Valley. And I used to be one of those restaurant owners that was married to my business, couldn't leave. The restaurant wouldn't be open if I wasn't here. I didn't trust anybody. I turned everything around. I've been here 10 full years, like I've said. I've defeated all the odds. I opened up this fine dining restaurant, upscale restaurant, in a small, depressed community. Um, I've learned a lot. I've made a lot of mistakes, and that's how I can confidently say I can help you. I can switch that mindset. I can teach you uh, tips and techniques that I've learned by doing it myself and then masterminding with some of the top restaurateurs in the country and marketing geniuses. It's been a great 10-year run. I don't regret a single part of it. Now the thing is, I work on my business. I don't work my business, which is a totally different thing. I can teach you how to do that. It's so simple with the tips and tools and techniques. Um, owning a restaurant can be a lot of fun, and I want to show you how to have fun in your restaurant. So please, send me an email.